الحمد للہ رب العالمین وصل اللہ وسلم على نبینا محمد وعلى علی وصحبہ وسلم مبار عی الحبت فی اللہ سپلکیشن as the Prophet وسلم said a dua huwa ibadah that dua or supplication is worship and a very important supplication that we need to be we all need to know in order to or in our quest for seeking forgiveness from Allah Azza wa Jal especially when we've been in a gathering so this is a reminder for myself and my brothers and sisters in Islam to not forget this supplication because often we have sittings and gatherings and when we leave we part without saying this gathering so say this gathering to yourself out loud or uh, before parting from a sitting or gathering the importance of this is because often when we sit more often than not we have a lot of un, uh, a lot of speech which is not beneficial a lot of false speech sometimes lying and 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 speaking about others and cursing others sometimes there's no benefit not only is there no benefit there's harm in what we speak about so it's imperative that we remember this dua and in the hadith which mentions or one of the ahadith that mention this beautiful dua showing us that ibadah comes in various forms to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and that all ibadah is to Allah and ta'zeemillah is the hadith of Abi Huraira radiyallahu ta'ala anhu and Abi Huraira radiyallahu ta'ala anhu qal qala rasulullahi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam من جلس في مجلس فكثر فيه لغته فقال قبل أن يقوم من مجلسه ذلك سبحانك سبحانك لهم سبحانك لهم وبحمدك أشهد أن لا إله إلا أنت أستغفرك وأتوب إليك إلا غفر له ما كان في مجلسه ذلك رواه أبو داود وترمذي وهذا لفظه أي لفظ الترمذي in this hadith of the Prophet صلى الله عليه وسلم the hadith of Abi Huraira رضي الله تعالى عنه he said that the messenger of Allah صلى الله عليه وسلم said whoever sits in a gathering and where there is a lot of general speech you know speech that is that requires clarification and it's just just general speech then a person should say before he gets up from this gathering subhanaka lahumma wa bihamdika all glory belongs to you o allah and all praises belong to you and I bear witness that there is no God except you and I seek forgiveness from you and I repent to you the one who says this that everything he will be forgiven everything that occurred in that that gathering in that sitting so habatifillah this is very important for us to remember these dua and supplication because even in sittings of goodness often sometimes we get we get off track unless you're blessed to be with ahla ilm then usually the conversations are generally pretty restricted even when they get off track a bit there's still gatherings of good and even in that situation you should say the supplication because the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa ordered us to and this was from his blessed sunnah
So Habatifillah, don't forget this great dua illustrating Ta'zimillah, just the greatness of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and Tawheed and supplicating to Allah and then all of our ibadah goes to Allah. Because in fact this dua, it illustrates for us uh, Tawheed al-Ibadah, the Tawheed of worship, Tawheed al-Uluhiyah, that all the worship goes to Allah because the person who supplicates with this supplication they're seeking forgiveness from Allah. And they are supplicating to Allah. And they are repenting to Allah. And they are beseeching Allah and glorifying Allah. So, Habatifillah, don't forget this supplication. And don't forget this opportunity to worship Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in a situation which, occur, which, which is so frequent for all of us. And we ask Allah the Almighty to accept our good and forgive our evil. Anything I said that was correct was from Allah Azza wa Jalla. Anything I said that was incorrect was from myself and the Shaytan. Subhanaka lahumu wa bihamdika shayru in la ilaha ila ant astaghfiruku wa tubu ilayk. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam.